What is up, party people? Welcome to Chicago, Illinois. We squeezed a lot in in the week that we were in Chicago. It was a good time. What? We're on the news. That's cool. That's Ryan and Katie. They're on TV. I don't know. I didn't know they were doing this. Here we played the Niederlander Theater in the heart of Chicago's theater district. Opened in 1926 is the Oriental Theater. This historic movie palace gone Broadway venue seats over 2,200. At noon on Tuesday, we headed from Grand Rapids to Chicago. And then got to Chicago about 2.30. And we did the show that night. Check. Tuesday. Done. Wednesday, we went to go see my friend Jamila kill it as Eliza in the Chicago cast of Hamilton. She's been playing Eliza for almost a full year now, and I am so thrilled I finally got to see her do it. Then our friend Heather came down from Grand Rapids to spend some time with us for the next couple days, and she got to see the show in Chicago on Wednesday night. She had just seen it in Grand Rapids, but what's super cool was Anthony ended up calling out on Wednesday night, so Mark went on for the role of Drew, and I went on for the role of Joey Primo. So she got to see a slightly different show than what she experienced last time. On Wednesday, we also celebrated Thomas's birthday. And after that, we went to a swanky opening for a rooftop bar called Essex Sky Bar. I think it might be pronounced Essex because I think it was in the Hotel Essex. That makes sense. I didn't make that connection until just now. Thursday, we spent some time exploring the city with Heather and doing the Chicago things that you do, like the bee, etc. And after the show, we went to go see Avengers Endgame because you know I'm one of those opening night guys. If you haven't seen it yet, Stop what you're doing right now and go see it because everybody's posting spoilers everywhere. I would be more mad about it if I hadn't already seen it, but I am I am still mad about it. Friday, Ginny and I had an eye appointment at Warby Parker to get new glasses because we desperately need glasses. This is how much I need new glasses. <laughs> and we got lunch with my friend Will, shame on me for not getting a picture, who I hadn't seen well, I guess I've seen him in like a year, but who I've known longer than I've known my wife. I did my first ever community theater production with Will. We did Altar Boys at Circle Theater in 2009. And after the show, we went out for a drink with some of the cast and crew at this swanky bar called Flight Bar, which is actually not a bar that specializes in, in selling flights, but a bar that specializes in throwing darts. There's like darts you can throw, flight. On Saturday, we did two shows, and it marks 12 performances in a row of me being somebody other than myself on stage. I had not been in my own track since the previous Tuesday. Um, not the Tuesday in Chicago, but Tuesday in, I don't even know what city we were in, to be honest. I don't remember. It's been that long. So my brain is kind of mushy. Goo! Sunday, Jenny and I said goodbye, but it's only for two weeks this time. Pew, 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 pew. She drove back down to Georgia and we finished out our nine show week with two more shows in Chicago. It was a great week. I can't wait to go back to the Windy City. But now we're off to Canada for two weeks, playing 10 shows in nine different cities in five different provinces. And next stop, Thunder Bay, Ontario. Thanks so much for coming out. Chase your dreams and cheers.